Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to Day of the Triffids episode 5 oh, already. I hope you're all doing really well. I can't believe I'm on episode 5, an ultimate episode. And it also means that I'm going to start the Avengers soon, which I'm kind of terrified about. I don't know why. I'm just scared. I always get scared starting something new. So, we still don't have Joe. We don't know where Joe is. I would assume that we will see Joe again. I just don't know in what capacity, but I do think we will see Joe again. Um, people still being killed off left, right and centre. Um, and we've still got the issue of the Triffids. So we're just not in a great predicament. Well, I say we, they. So fingers crossed Bill can just because he's got a good head on him. I have faith that he can he can get through it. It's just he needs to find Joe and then they need to tally ho to the countryside. So let's see what's going to happen. Are yours all dead? They will be back tomorrow. Same in mine. They got it right. We've got to start again. Mm -hmm. My question is. That's oh, lovely house. I'm sorry to keep you waiting. But as you can imagine, there's so much to do. Miss Darren, I'm particularly looking for the young girl that I was with at the university. Uh, you may remember us together. She was tall, blonde, about 23. Her name was Peyton. Miss Peyton? No, I can't help you, I'm afraid. Well, she's certainly not here now. Of course, she may have gone with the others. I can't be sure of that. In fact, it was Mr. Beadley who knew of this house. But there were a few of us who fundamentally disagreed with their ideas as to the future of society. Mm. You may remember they gave us an outline of those ideas that night at the university. Uh, yes, I remember. They seem to believe that the human race cannot survive without the complete abolition of morality as we've understood it before. That everything should be subservient to the production of children. And that whether or not a child is a child of true love is of no importance at all. You mustn't let him persuade you to bring any more blind people here. You can just about cope with what you've got, if things are properly handled, that is, any more than you've had it. If you I mean, don't all starve to death, the ones who can see will have both mental and physical breakdowns trying to cope with the ones who can't. This is not speculation. This is predicted fact. You did your best. Let's go. of vultures. I was ready for that. But there's more and more all the time. They seem to know where we are. They turned towards us when they saw the lorries. Some even moved towards us. They didn't see the lorries. The plants, they can't see. They can hear them. Village after village, house after house, not a breath of human life anywhere. But Triffids will get to Tinsham. So, there's one reason my human need, but the right. main reason is this. He sat by the window, it's going to come through. I've been working this out on the road. We must be part of a community to have any hope for the future at all. Yeah, I know. I'll get my way of tension. Have to use more subtlety. For my Durant needs us. I'm not going with you. Why not? I've got to find Joe. You don't know 
don't even know if she's still alive. Considering how little time he knew her for, it's right. very sweet. But I'm gonna find out. Interesting they didn't show his face. Showed the body of a child. That actually does look like the South Downs. not do anything at night time then. A lot of driving in this one, hasn't there? They're all gonna be dead. They must have left a message about where they were going. I couldn't find one. But what happened? The disease. You could smell it. There were bodies everywhere, including Miss Dance. What about Coca? I don't know. There were six new graves outside. We're on our own then. We've got to try and make a go of it here. I just don't know what's going to happen about the Triffids. Like, I don't, I don't see an end point with them getting rid of the Triffids. So I don't, I don't see an end point. Um, that bit where Susan was like, oh, I don't know what's happened to him. And her little brother was lying there and then they buried him was horrific. 
because she obviously had lost her parents as well so that was brutal seeing that little boy's body seeing all the other bodies to be honest and the corpses has been really quite haunting um we've got one episode to go they're in a location i wouldn't say it's a safe location because they are surrounded by triffids and the triffids know they are there so they must smell them and hear them i don't know how we are going to get past the fact that the country is swarmed by triffids i know there's loads of other things they've got to deal with but I don't know how we get past this whole Triffid situation. I don't know. I will be very interested to see what happens. I mean, part of me is thinking actually in part six, we won't even see the resolve. We'll just see them managing. Um, so I mean, terrify it's a terrifying concept and one that I don't think that this, is something going to happen to this country anytime soon? I'm not saying that it's not going to happen, but yeah, hopefully not in my lifetime. So thank you for joining me. I will see you next week for the final episode.